Hi guys, welcome back to another Steam free-to-play walkthrough. Today we have Naginato, which is a side-scroller beat-em-up from the land of Japan. Well, I don't know if it's from Japan, but we're in Japan trying to protect Kyoto. Kyoto, which is an anagram from Tokyo, but they're not the same place. I think Kyoto used to be like the capital though, but I'm not sure about that. Don't quote me. A is your attack key, S is your jump key, which threw me off really hard at the start. And that jump key takes me nowhere at all. I don't know if there's any other keys. Dash. W does something else too, like a Hadouken. Hadouken! Okay, W only shoot. W is hard to use, god dang. Am I dead? I'm dead. Freaking screw the W key, boy. W key is useless. God dang. That dang, uh, that was not doing it for me. I might need to lower the game difficulty. I suck, apparently. W, A. W goes across the whole map though, which is kind of cool, but it sucks. Okay, W sucks. Let's just go. Screw the W key. We're running the distance. We're gonna run the gauntlet, boys. I'm dying. Okay. We're not running anything. I suck. Oh, let me get that star! Oh, they're killing me! It does nothing! Oh, I'm so screwed, actually. Wait, wait, wait. No. Health! Oh my god. This is so hard. <laughs> it's so hard. He goes, he's shooting Hadoukens as well, but there's actually work. So, I don't know how I'm supposed to feel about that. I don't think this is controller compatible either. I tried to use my controller, it wasn't doing this stuff for me. I don't know what that little bar, it filled up my bar at the bottom, but I don't know what that means for our hero. Nothing. Maybe it powered up my attack or something. Dang, dang, dude. Dang, dude. Oh, get off me. Maybe it is a, a finite amount of enemies, which makes it a lot more manageable. Because I'll backtrack there and I didn't get more enemies, so that's good. I'm excited to hear that. So you're telling me there's a chance. And the further you... Probably the further fur, the for, forward you go, the more enemies you get. So probably screwing myself by trying to rush this. Front flip. Front flip. <laughs> Ah, uh, front flip. Ah, they got me. Alright, little shiny star, help me! It's not helping me. It's not helping me! I'm dead! Oh my god, dead again. Hopefully this level doesn't have like a final boss, because I'm one hit from failure. And you only get one chance apparently before game over. I'm gonna take it slow. I'm gonna spawn one enemy at a time. Like a good boy. Oh, what the fuck? Oh my god, my death perception. I could have swore he was way too north to hit me, but apparently my geisha chick's head's so freaking huge. She just got popped, like, right in the freaking grill, dog. Oh my god. Alright, guys, full disclosure, I lowered the game level to two. Because this game is a little bit... I don't think... I, it's hard, but I think it's hard for the wrong reasons. You're not very maneuverable as the main character. Like, I feel like the monsters have the same maneuverability, if not. Well, you might have a little bit more, but not much when you're not shooting. Um, and your hitbox is freaking huge compared to the enemy's dog. You are the biggest thing in the world, and you get hit all the time. It feels like the enemy projectiles from the ghost are like so much better than mine because they're aiming at something that's freaking huge, apparently. Miss Geisha has like a freaking dome. God dang, dude. And you don't get health in between stages? Are you freaking kidding me? Oh my god. I get they die in one hit, but Jesus, dude. What? <laughs> you don't get health back, bro? What the? They hit die in one hit on game level two. If you do it on the default, it takes like two or three, which is tragic because you're getting fl flake cuts. What? Did you see how much health that- that gave me nothing, bro. Nothing. Oh my god, dude. What the tarnation. Oh, this is... Not a fun beat-em-up for me. If you want a really challenging one... I- I won't say it plays well, though, because it feels... Like you're limited in your movement a ton. And this jump is useless. Oh, that healed a lot more than the first one. That's nice, I guess. Oh, hell, health everywhere. Let's go. Thank you, creator. Jesus, please. I think it's kind of sad that you don't full heal between stages, but whatever, man. It's better that at least you dropped some nice health packs in there. 
But yeah, game difficulty three. Good luck, dude. I'm sure it's beatable, but god dang. It, I, I don't think it'd be fun to beat. Obviously your maneuverability goes up when you're not shooting, which is something I have to come to terms with because I like to spam the attack, which is probably not the best strategy. I want to test something real quick. Yeah, okay. If you are like shooting and try to turn to the left, it takes like an extra like hold of it for it to work. But if you're like not attacking, you can just straight up switch directions, which is good, I guess. I think that's trying to like imply some skill here, but god dang, dude, Kyoto ain't worth it. This ain't even Tokyo we're talking about. This is Kyoto. The inferior anagram. Oh, boss fight. We're so screwed, dude. I can feel it. I hear the music. This is the, your screwed music. Good luck, son. <laughs> Good luck, music. Prepare your booty hole. They're giving me my health back before I get dunked on. I still don't know what the bar at the top left means. It doesn't seem like it makes my attack stronger or faster. It might give me a special attack that I don't know how to use, but... It's gotta be a special attack, right? How do I use it? D. And I, okay, well at least I know. I mean, I, oh, boss. What's up? Oh, he's weak, boy. Oh, baby. Oh, I'm level two difficulty. Well, at least we know the bosses are very beatable, but the minions, the minions are the problem, bro. They just straight up freaking dunked me. Like, it's not even funny. <laughs> not funny, bro. God dang. Oh, look at the pink ghosts. Oh my God, they're more likely to shoot than the white ghosts. He's Yeah, dude, I don't know. It just feels like her hitbox is freaking massive because like For me to hit something it has to be on the same plane as me of my attack for them They can be like a little bit above or below me and I still get hit and it's freaking toxic attack. It's frustrating oh, God dude I have, Oh boy Now it takes two hits to kill those skulls again, which is a problem because they're fast attack Oh my god, dude! I tried to use my special attack and they cucked me. They straight up ran up on me, canceled my special attack, I'm dead. Do I have to start all the way over? Oh, thank god. Are you- yes. 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 Thank god, dude. <laughs> oh, at least unless you continue from stage two, because it- Stage one, you die, you're all the way over. I just hate how you're constantly flanked, too. When you just don't maneuver well to begin with. You maneuver alright, but not well. And the jump's useless. God, the jump is so useless. It looks cool. Wow. But like, give me a second. Once I clear this area, I'll show you. It just like, makes it impossible to move. Like, look how slow I'm going while I'm jumping. That feels terrible, bro. Oh, yeah. Yikes. I mean, it's not, it's not a terrible game, but I don't think it's a fun one. It's like, I... I don't know. It's very like Super Nintendo side scroller beat em up challenge. I haven't played many side scroller beat em ups though where you have like a constant projectile. Maybe it's supposed to be like Goemon, which I also suck at. That might be, yeah, that might be why I suck at this. It's the type of game that I suck at. It's not the game, it's me. I've come to that, I've come to that conclusion. People that like this type of game will probably like this game. I'm not those people. It's not you, creator. It's me. It's me! But this is so hard, dude. I like... Okay, the white ghosts don't turn around. The pink ghosts do turn around. I, I do like how you can get behind the white ghosts, though, and they're just like, Oh, I don't know what to do! Oh! Huh. God dang it, dude. I thought I had at least one more hit left. I thought freaking wrong. Or just take your time and go really slow so you only spawn one wave of the enemies at a time. Because almost one step forward is usually like an enemy. Sometimes it's not. Like there, I didn't get an enemy for like four steps. But you can control the waves if you don't go. I just feel like you should be able to <laughs> move at your own pace, but that's not how this works. It spawns based off of how far you move forward. I hate these underwear women. But yeah. I do think I do suck at this type of game, but I I don't know. I just feel like this is really hard. <laughs> like, 
I feel like the hitbox, like, oh my god, I just feel like the hitbox puts him at such an advantage over me, it's not right. It's just not right, bro. Huh. Thank god. Well, if I die, I'll probably have to start all the way back over, but, oh well. Remember, take your time. That's hard for me, bro. I'm a very impatient. God dang, did you see her weave up, shoot me? I wish I could play like she does. She's really good. She like hit me up top, weave back down, fucking hit me again. <laughs> I want to be as good as she is. And my freaking things. Look at that, their rocket compared to my little rocket that goes across the map. It's so small. So small. Inferiority complex to the max, fully. This goes, but it only goes halfway. Toxic. Woo! 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 They make it very hard to hit them, to be honest with you. I am the protector of Kyoto. I demand a bigger energy ball, god dang it. Yeah, that's one thing. I think I already said this, but I'll repeat myself just in case I said it while I was dying continuously. Um, that's one thing I don't think this has that Goemon had is you can upgrade your attacks in Goemon, I'm pretty sure. Bro, the hitbox. This is impossible. This is impossible. No, it's not impossible. It's just really hard. Something hit me from off. Oh, son of a... Do I have to start all the way over? I think I do. I need health. I don't need a power-up thing. I need health. Power up only lasts for so long. Health is until I get hit again. Which is probably soon. Health? Oh my god, please. Give me health. Oh my god, that's not health. That is not health. That is a blue star. Health is not a blue star. Health is a rice ball on a geary thing. Please, gosh. I need it. Well, at least I only- Ah, uh, jinxed it. I was about to say, well, at least they're only spawning from one side. Wrong. Maybe I can cuck them before they come on screen with the W key. That's- Oh my god, is that food? Get away from my food! Oh, she's too freaking large! Big-headed girl? God dang, her head is deceptively freaking huge, dog. Oh my god. Can you believe it? Yes, yes, I'm making it. I'm really making it. Must there be like a really hard final boss? The first boss was like super easy and then the final boss was, I know this isn't the final, final level, but when I get to the final boss, he better not be like ridiculous or something. Oh, I'd be mad. I'd be real mad. Lower the game level to one. Come back. <laughs> I'm on two right now, which is still pretty weak, but I mean, I cannot do three. Like I've already said many times, I'm not good at this type of game, and this one is exceptionally hard. There we go, boss fight time. I just wish there was something that would be a power-up to make my attack a little bit larger or make my hitbox smaller, like a shrinking power-up or something. Permanent shrink on that chick's big old fat dome, you feel me? My god, that would be nice. Gosh, she's got a freaking massive melon. It doesn't look that massive, but when you start getting hit by these freaking shots, you feel it. You can feel the massiveness of that goddamn chrome dome. Oh hell, she ain't taking no damage! Oh, what is this? Take this! Oh my god. Oh my god, we won. Why wasn't she taking damage at the start, bro? Oh, I'm scared. <laughs> I was like, if I die here, tell, tell the creator, fuck you. <laughs> oh, it's a boss. Now, my tips would be, Go as slow as humanly possible through the stages. Um, hit the things that are moving first, even though that sounds like bad advice, because the shooters are more annoying. They won't rush you. The things that rush you are like homing missiles, pretty much. 
but you gotta hit them first, even though I hate it because playing shooters build up is toxic. Especially with your massive hitbox, Lloyd. Oh my god. Last thing you want is like four bullets coming across the screen at all different angles. Oh hell, I can't even hit that thing. Uh oh, she's launching things from the grave. That's that one one chick, right? Oh, it's an evil baby. What? Oh. Did my hitbox get smaller on this map, or what happened here? I'm not getting hit. So, let me jinx it like an idiot. Your boy. Doing the dumb stuff. That's me. The unhittable thing. It's coming back for revenge. Making its return trip. It thirsts for my blood. But yeah, if the creator... Honestly, if he changed one of the things, I think this game would be like... A lot more fun or enjoyable is like make the character feel strong and if he wants to do a higher difficulty I feel like that's how it should be but that's just my opinion like I said I'm not a game creator so I could be wrong and some people probably like this type of game hard it's their genre and they probably love it hard so this is for you guys but for a casual player of this type of game Maneuverability would be nice, or a smaller hitbox, or a power-up for your attacks. Any of those things. I'll take any of them. I'm dead. I'm so dead. They are launching things, like, and I missed? Oh my god, it doesn't hit them if they're off screen. This is bullshit! <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> what the fuck? Oh my god, they just built up an army, bro. They built up an army. This goes off screen. Your ultimate does not go off screen at all. I could even see their bullets and my ultimate didn't hit them. That was tragic, dude. I cannot, cannot express how much I just want to throw all the curse words in the world because that ultimate hit nothing. And I knew they were there. The ultimate knew they were there. And it still missed. That was freaking awful. God, see how small the hitbox on my attack is compared to these suckers? I'm just gonna do this. What if I do this? I can just kill things before they spawn, right? This is the play. Yeah. And now I gotta make sure they don't spawn from behind me, but this is looking good. I like this. Yeah, we do the weave. We call it the weave, boys. Oh, weavy boy. That's how we do. Is this how we do? Okay. Okay. I think this might take out the fun of the game, but hey, man. Well, I mean, I, I was struggling so much, I don't know if I was having too much fun in the first place, but... Hey! Oh no! The spinny wheel of death! Watch this. Oh. Yeah, that goes a lot better when you do the up and down motion. The motion of the ocean. Oh my god, I'm missing! Not that time, boys. I made sure. Oh God, they're all spawning. I used my ultimate the wrong way. I've never seen those things shoot anything till just now. Surprise attack, baby. Just the way I like it. I like when enemies learn new attacks. Surprise! I could have been doing this the whole time, but I haven't. Well, thanks, man. Oh, that's a big health thing because it's got the it's got the nori seaweed on it. That's how you know. Gonna heal you a ton of HP, because that seaweed stuff actually is pretty delicious, surprisingly. When I look at seaweed in the ocean, I'm like, that looks disgusting. But when they... The Japanese have perfected in making that a very edible product. Very sticky and good. I only know from sushi, but good enough sushi. Good stuff. I would probably eat it without the sushi. Is that a boss? Oh, this is like a pre-boss boss, right? What's she doing? What are you doing? Oh, she's dead now. God dang, mini boss boy. Oh, blue head girl. Her head bigger than my head. That's one good thing about the bosses, bro. They got a bigger hitbox than me. That's nice. These mobs do not have a bigger hitbox than me. I will not be convinced otherwise. My hitbox is freaking massive. I'm glad the bosses have to feel my pain. Feel my pain! And suffering. And I'm dead. Because they're... 
chain's banking me and I don't want to die. I like that that dude has like a really small attack like I do. His is smaller than mine actually, which is kind of cool. I approve of that. I'm doomed. They're spawning everywhere. I went too fast or something. Son of a ding dong. Oh my god. I want to live. I want to live. I've made it so far. Please. I have a family. Oh, freaking, oh my god, sickest juke of the 21st century. Oh my god, they're killing me! I like the soundtrack in this game, that's one good thing. I need health, boy. I need health. I forgot my strategy, let's go back to the strategy. Oh, we made it. Oh, but I have no health. Oh, I'm so screwed, actually. Well, please give me a health thing. Please, sir, can I have a rice ball? Please? That is not a rice ball. That is nothing. I got nothing. That is also not a rice ball, but it is something, so that's something I got. Yes. Please, don't kill me before I get to my rice ball, sir. They're, oh my god, they're being... Oh! Okay. Oh, I just could have... I felt my doom with their big forehead and it made me scream out and just grunt all the very disgruntled by the fact that I was pop Fudge, dude, her head's so big! I'm gonna watch all the special moves when I get to the boss. I oh, I promise you, I'm gonna launch him. One more health thing. Of course not! I only have one! It did no damage! Oh, this is bold. Oh! No! It's taking up the whole screen! My head is too big! <laughs> no. Okay, if you tag too soon, the boss doesn't take damage. I'm tracking. It warned me in the second fight, but I didn't listen. Thank God, dude. Is all we done, or is there another one? Oh my God, this game's so hard. <laughs> Oh, Chrome Dome Girl. Oh, the ending. Oh, we don't get a freaking ending. We just get a rank D. Oh, you can rank suck D's nuts, god damn. Rank suck this dick. Oh, god, I could not. Is there a way out of here? Alright, guys. So, my review of this game is, if you like these type of games, play it, man. Uh, it is not for me. It is. There's no way to change your controls. Game level 3 for me is impossible. Game level 2 is almost impossible. Um, yeah, so honestly, if this was, if they wanted to make this more for a casual player, they would either include one of the following or maybe multiple of the following. Power-ups for your attack because the enemies have better attacks than you do. It has a bigger range, like it's bigger radius on the attack. It has, long, it has like full range like your small attack does. Um, your hitbox is huge. God dang, your hitbox is huge. Um, freaking, you don't get your health back between stages, which kind of sucks, but at least you can continue, so I'm not mad about that. That's about the same thing, almost. Freaking, um, and your mobility's pretty low. Like, you can jump attacks, but God, if they shoot another one right after you're done, son, you're gonna get hit anyways. <laughs> I had that happen, I tested it. You probably won't see it, because I'll probably cut it out, but dang, I jumped one and I got smacked right after I came down. I was like, you son of a ding dong. Uh, yeah, but my tips also are go as slow as possible throughout the stage, because you can, uh, the more, the faster you go, the more things you're gonna spawn. Follow your special attack if you launch it because you can hit more enemies that way. And if as long as your special attack kills the front, the game's not too bad if you're not getting flanked, but you constantly get flanked throughout the game. Um, which isn't a problem. Flank is fine, as long as one of the other things was implemented. For casual players, I'm sure there's players that kill this stuff that love it. Uh, but yeah. Alright guys, thanks for watching as always. Bye!